What's up you guys, friends here. I hope you all are doing well, being productive, and mainly just being safe at times like this. If you haven't subscribed yet to my channel, please do hit the subscribe button below. Sige na, please. And for today's video, I will be teaching you tips and tricks on how to use a flat iron. And for today's video, we would need a model for sure. And who else can model for me than a training head? Guys, begin at the name. What should I name her? Comment down below. And for today's video, I would be using the GHT Gold Flat Iron. I've been using this for two, three years. Yeah, it's a bit expensive, but it'll last you like super long, super durable, and it, it works. I love it. So first off, I would um, show you how to straighten hair. So her hair now is like air dried. It's a bit wavy. And then I will just take a section to show you guys on how to just take that out of the way. So we will use this part to show you how to straighten hair. So basically what you need is your fat iron and a comb. So you take a section of hair and you place your comb there and then you put your flat iron on top of the comb and then slowly go down. Just go slowly. The goal is to have like just one stroke. You want to really lock in that shine. Let the flat iron do the work for you. You don't have to press it too hard. It doesn't have to hurt, guys. So once again, take a comb, the hair, and then put in the flat iron over it, and then pull it down. Very slowly. Plus, if you do this, it'll make your hair more shiny. the plates have more time to work on the hair see compared to this it's shiny with just one stroke guys so yeah let's do one more let's do one more for you like that and then pull it down really slow and gentle Yeah, take it slow, guys. Parang sa relationship lang yan. Take it slow. There we go. As you can see, it is shiny now. Shiny and straight. Excuse me. Yeah, it is shiny and straight now. Yeah, okay. Next is... Let's take this out of the way. Let's do this side. Next is I will teach you how to curl with your flat iron. So basically you just take your hair and if you're doing it from this side, you want it like away from the face, then this side is the other way. One trick that I do to use your left hand for this side, I'll show you. And then take your flat iron and then pull it downwards like that and then pull it down keep pulling it down slowly yeah and then it'll turn that side and if you do that here you use your right hand If you use your right hand, it'll turn also away from the face. Then you can twist it around your finger and then let it set for a bit and then pull it. Let it set like that. See, they're both going away from the face. That hair, then use your left hand 
It's always downwards. There we go. And then you can pin it in place, let it set, you can pin it, and then work on the others, or you can just let it set like that. But if you want it like a, a looser curl, if you want a looser curl, a more loose curl, let's say, just do it quicker. And then you can pull it a bit, pull it downwards. So yeah, it's a more loose curl. There we go. And then one more curl that I can show you is Take this hair, take the flat iron, twist it, and then you have to point the flat iron downwards. There you go. This is more of like a beach wave for me. This is, I like this more than the normal curl. I use it more. And then for beach waves, if you don't want it to bundle up, you place it in like different directions. You make it different directions. So there are ones like facing away from the face, there are ones not facing away from the face. You can always go back, why not? It's hair. Let's make it fun. So this is going towards that way. And then you can spray a little texturizing hair sp texturizing spray or texturizing hairspray for it. For more texture. I use the IGK Beach Club. It's, this is my favorite, it's super nice. It smells like coconut, it smells like the beach. And yeah, now we have a different model right here. I want to show you one of my favorite things that I do with the flat iron. It's the mermaid waves, which you see all the time on Instagram. So basically, I would put a lot of the beach club spray all over the hair for hold and texture. So. How I would do hair is, I would do the halo parting. Basically, it's just making a halo in your head. Clip that up. And so that I can work with the important parts of the hairstyle. So it's here and then around here. So yeah, that's how I do it. And then you take your flat iron and and then place it here, curl it downward, and then put it the other way, and then put it the other way again. The other way, and then the end, pull, just pull it down. There we go. And then you can do as tight or as loose as you can. So we can make this a little bit tighter. There's no rules really. Just have fun with your hair. Put it down. Other way. Other way again. Other way. And right at the end, you pull it downwards. And then you can do that. More texture. Do one more. Down and 
other way, put down, put down. <laughs> yeah. Do that for the texture. And then I'm gonna do the whole head. And there we go, just a little bit more texture spray. lock it in with a little bit more hairspray and look at that they're mermaid waves this is actually my favorite so guys I hope you learned a lot from me today please do hit the subscribe button if you haven't subscribed yet and please do comment down below what you think if you have questions i will answer them right away and i hope i'll see you next time on my next vlog bye <laughs>